this might be the worst mistake of my life. Oh my god, this is not fucking scary! This is, oh my god, why did I go for this? <laughs> what is up and welcome to my channel everybody. And guess what we're doing today? We're going to a place called Dream Island, which is located in Moscow. And this place is legit awesome. Check this out. And you know what's even more awesome, guys? That I basically wrote an email to the guys and I was like, I'd love to film in your place. And they're like, hey mate, we got you. We're gonna give you a few tickets and you can come in. Unlimited ride. So let's go check it out. I've never been here. Should be freaking awesome. Check this out, guys. This is basically like a shopping mall. And this Dream Island place is not like, you know, a lot of people compare it to like, uh, Disneyland and stuff like that but it's not because Disneyland is a park and this is basically like a shopping mall type of uh, fun activity stuff that you could do I've never been there but this shopping mall looks legit awesome I mean have you seen a shopping mall like this anywhere before check this out guys and the thing is it's like uh, nearly 3 30 p.m. on a Wednesday and there's not a lot of people here but we're gonna see how the actual like dream island is gonna be like and i can't wait for it because there's so many cool things and my girlfriend was already there before so i think that should be cool i've never been there and uh i'm quite afraid of stuff like that because i know it's safe but you never know what the engineers were up to when they were doing it guys like we're not even in the actual place we need to be yet but this place is legit awesome check this out Damn guys, check this ride out. Dang, it's a Mercury as well. Oh damn, that looks good, man. That looks good. What is it? A Mercury 8 Club Coupe. Damn, this is nice. Damn, look at those rims. You can't even go without an American car in a Russian shopping mall. Like, come on. American cars rule, I swear to God. And there's a Jeep with this. Oh my God, what the heck? This is so random as well. Check this out. Check this out. It's a Jeep Willis. Dang, look at this. The heck is it doing over here in this shopping mall? I have absolutely no idea. And I just found the place. Basically the entrance to the place. Right there. Look at that. Okay, we need to find our tickets that uh, basically the whole place just gave to us for free and that's freaking awesome so we need to find an information place and i think i found it it's right there check this out guys free tickets damn this is good this is good you can see it says zero rubles right here because we're legit too cool to pay money in russia and we're in boys we're in russia check this out this is awesome damn absolutely freaking free are you serious guys this is like the best thing this youtube thing is just awesome look how cool it is here this is the biggest theme park type of thing inside a shopping mall in europe you could see there's like shop souvenir shop and stuff like that right there this is crazy this is so cool oh this is legit cool guys just look at the whole place it's magical you could do like all sorts of activities here you could i don't know i need to go on something absolutely crazy so i shit my pants that's what i want to do here and this is like hum this is this is all inside a building as well inside a building who the hell makes a park inside a building this is crazy guys it's a wednesday what the fuck is going on with my camera 
So guys, it's a Wednesday and the amount of people here is absolutely wild. Look at this. So many people here, you can't even imagine. How am I gonna go and do anything with that amount of people? This is crazy. I probably should have came here like early, early in the morning so that we don't have to stay in queues. But anyways, it's still awesome. I need to get on something right now. What the hell is this? This is a Hello Kitty, whatever, theater. I thought the first attraction that I should go on is the scariest one so I'm gonna shit my pants once and then I'll be all good for the other ones this might be the worst mistake of my life oh god guys I don't want to die I don't want to die <laughs> This is just absolutely the scariest thing probably I've ever went on. Guys, my heart is like thumping so badly right now. I legit thought this was the end. This is just crazy, guys. And uh, yeah, I want to thank the park for uh, giving me free tickets for me and Evelina. This is awesome. This is like a very scary park. Let's get the heck out of here. This is absolutely freaking crazy. Oh my God. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh my God, this is crazy guys. We're gonna check out different ones now. But, oh my God guys, I thought literally that I'm gonna fly off into the room. I literally did that for you guys. I probably wouldn't have even like went on it if it wasn't for you guys. But hopefully my reaction was funny. I was legit like scared because it was going higher and higher just crazy so now we're gonna go to a VR type of thing and we're gonna check it out because Evelina wants to go on it you're probably not gonna see much but you're just gonna see me in VR goggles if the queue isn't that big I do feel a bit sick to be honest with you. that was wild the queues here are like for an hour and look at the queue it's absolutely humongous and then there's like people skipping just because they're moms and stuff like that. And uh, it's so annoying. Oh my God. I mean, it's worth it, but not worth for standing for like an hour or so. Yeah, there's no way we're gonna stand here for an hour. Пройди, пройди, пожалуйста. Здравствуйте, спасибо. Yeah, that woman is a bitch. Because there's so much people in this like place that it's like impossible to actually go in into one of the good attraction basically because 
this like roller coasters because there's so many people here it's crazy but it's cool but too many people so we're gonna go to a place called hotel transylvania right there i'm gonna see what's up in the big hotel and it looks like a big castle as well look at that It's a nice looking place, but the amount of people here is just absolutely crazy. What the heck? This is probably gonna take like a few hours or something like that. Yeah, there's absolutely no way I'm gonna go on that. That's like basically made for puking. That is, after that one, it's really sketchy. <laughs> oh, we should go one of those. <laughs> but it's truly honestly crazy by the amount of people here. Look at this. that there's no seat belts on this thing check this out absolutely no seat belts oh, okay that feels safer Screaming her guts out. Yeah, look at this. Oh, that was fun. That was fun. Okay, where's my phone? <laughs> Guys, you wanted, and so many streams, you wanted to hear like Russian swear words. Here's the Russian swear words from you, <laughs> from Evelina. <laughs> Evelina, it was so scared. Like, she went on the first one that i went without me when i wasn't even here like last year and she said it's like the scariest thing and she got so scared of that uh, snake thing oh my god but uh you know it does feel scary because you go up high and you spin around just it's crazy absolutely crazy look at this dinosaur damn this is nice oh guys check this out so there's a castle right there there's like fog right here as well. Dang, this is cool. Guys, you can't imagine how scared Evelina was. It was so funny. You've probably seen it, but it's just absolutely hilarious. And uh, she was like, I'm not gonna go on any of those anymore, but I'm gonna get her to go on something. And uh, yeah, I've been told that once it's gonna be later in the evening, there's gonna be less and less people here. So we would be able to try out more and more uh, things but yeah this place is actually quite expensive for an ordinary russian person a ticket to here costs around like 50 dollars 
And yeah, yeah, it's fifty dollars all inclusive, so that you can do like whatever. But I'm really enjoying this place. It's awesome. This place is truly beautiful. I mean, check this out. It's all colorful, and uh, it's like a dreamland. This is supposedly the haunted house. It's a haunted house, guys. I don't know why people bring kids with them. So we just came out of the haunted house. It wasn't actually scary because there was a lot of people in them, but if they have like less people, it'd be scary. But check this out. You walk into a shop. Красиво, да? So you walk out of the place into a shop basically and you can get yourself some stuff. So we walked into some souvenir shop in this place. Check this out, you can get all sorts of souvenirage that you need nice guys if you have watched the, like what was it video two days ago basically you remember my friend cleaning a car and uh, wiping down the roof of a car and uh, look they're selling t-shirts with his hand now very nice so guys the place we went to on that spinning thing where Evelina was screaming was called Mowgli and Dinosaur and check this out this car looks legit awesome this is like a russian uaz look at this oh, this is cool this is so cool check this out all of this place is just nice absolutely nice so guys, we tried a lot of stuff here. We didn't try everything because the amount of people here is absolutely crazy and it'll take us like a few hours to actually get onto more like roller coasters and stuff like that. So I thought we've been here for like four hours and we're hungry as heck. So we're gonna leave the place and uh, have some food and then go home because we're tired as heck. We've been here for like four or five hours or something like that. Oh my god guys look what i found goodbye mcdonald's goodbye mcdonald's the heck is this place it's all closed down the heck can i get some food please so i got myself some shin ramen and i'm gonna have it and then we're gonna go home Oh yeah, we got the thing. So Evelina got herself a corn dog. I got myself some ramen and I asked them to make it like super spicy. So let's have a try and see if it's actually like spicy or not. I wonder. I have a feeling that this is instant ramen for some reason though, to be honest with you. You never know in those places. Okay, so I'm gonna have a try of Evelina's corn dog. I've never actually had a corn dog in my life. So let's have a go. I would have imagined that it would be better in the States because in here it's just it's nasty. Well, I feel absolutely ripped off because that tasted like $2 cup noodles for like 20 bucks. What the heck? That's a rip off. I feel ripped off. Don't go to that place called Sol Seal. It's an absolute rip off and it's a lie. I mean, that's that, that tasted like the instant noodles that I buy like for my house goodbye dream island and yeah that was a good experience i guess it was quite enjoyable so guys hopefully you enjoyed this video and if you did please leave a like subscribe and comment in the comment section below and i'm gonna go home and drink a bit of pepsi